Good morning, everybody. Hope you all had a fantastic start to the week. Yesterday it was gorgeous weather. Um, we had the Jewish holiday of Yom Kippur, so my family and I were doing Zoom Temple. Um, yesterday was so gorgeous. I'm really excited to show y'all some shoes today because the weather has been just perfect fall weather and a lot of times we don't get much of that. Um, yesterday was a lot hotter than I expected. Between uh, services, we actually went and walked around my parents' circle. They live on this little pond. It's really beautiful. They have a pathway that goes around it. My dad actually loves to fish back there. He catches one pound basses and he's so excited. He literally thinks that this little pond in his backyard is offshore fishing. Um, <laughs> Oh, I gotta stop talking about him, he's coming. <laughs> uh, but we went and walked around and my mom looked at my back and I was wearing like a heavy linen shirt. And she goes, there's something on your shirt. I was like, that's, that's sweat. It's a lot hotter out here than I expected. Um, so today we're gonna talk about fall fashion and how to, you know, transition from those summer sandals into some of your booties. <gasps> Hi, Becca. Um, transition into some of those fall booties and do layering so that you know on days like yesterday and um on days where the morning is cooler you know layering to be able to take off some stuff once it does get hotter throughout the day um hi mary so i thought back on everything and i did facebook live videos before covid but just very few and far in between so today technically marks exactly six months since I started these series consistently. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. Um, I just can't believe that if you really add it up, in that first week of videos, I think I showed y'all over 1,500 shoes. <laughs> and now on a weekly basis, I show you about 20. <laughs> Good morning, Tabitha. Oh, I'm actually gonna show y'all a couple kids shoes today too, Tabitha, so stay tuned to the end. Um, I've pulled a bunch of boots. I haven't pulled every color that everything comes in. I haven't pulled all that brand. So just make sure that you are checking out our website, saxonshoes.com, because we will be posting everything on there as soon as it comes in. Um, Dad, you wanna come say hi? I have two guest hosts today. Mr. Gary Weiner And our model, our model, Miss Beth. <laughs> We got Nora too, but she's a staple. She's been my model. Um, and Cooper's here too. He's hanging out in the background. Say hi, Cooper. My happy puppy. So this morning um, I got up and I left the lights off when I went to shower. So I got back into my room and he was still sleeping. And he saw me come in and all you can hear, you can't see him, but you can just hear his tail just lapping on the bed. He's so cute. I'm obsessed with my dog. So. Why don't we just go ahead and get started? We'll start with um, some cool women's shoes and then we're gonna show you some men's, but stay tuned because we'll show some kids at the end. Um, I know we showed cho Chocolate Blue last week, but we did get in a couple more styles and these are 100% on point, on trend with what's going on this year. First I wanna show you is a new fashion sneaker. This is in that pony hair that we have in the other styles as well. Um, Janice, I saw you just log in. This next shoe I'm about to show is 100% you, um, but I love this lace-up. It's very trendy. It's got um, not necessarily the dirty sole. It looks a little bit sleeker. This is great with jeans, great with dresses, um, just super easy. And then next we have... So last week I showed you the open toe version in the black and gold cow this week we have the closed toe in the natural and cow hair this is so cute this is great i love this shoe because this is one of those shoes that you can wear from shorts to dresses to um, pants and it's just going to look cool with everything i know that everybody's you know held up in your houses but there's no reason that you can't feel good and look nice while doing it and this is one of those cute casual comfortable shoes it's got the um dna of chocolate blue perfect Good morning, Hilda. So I have my mom modeling this shoe. Let's see how she does. Uh-huh. So beautiful. You're so good at this, mom. <laughs> okay. So 
Next, um, we just got these Minnetonkas in. It's a little early for a full-on Ugg boot. It's hot outside still. Um, a good way to combat that is, you know, wearing socks with fur will help your feet sweat less too. But something like this, we just got these in from Minnetonka. Look at how cute that is. A little slide, a little mule with a little fur collar on it. It's fur lined on the inside too. This is ridiculously lightweight. These shoes are only $49.95. You get a full sole on them. So this is one of those shoes that you can wear as a slipper or wear out. Super cool. I love, you guys know I'm a sucker for a blush shoe. But you've got a nice suede with the fur faux fur collar. And I got Nora to model that one for us. I hope Lynn's watching because Lynn would love that clog that you were wearing too, Mom. Good morning, Elena. Look at how cute that is. This is a perfect work from home shoe, but still can go out in it so you don't have to change before you go to the grocery store. And the little outfit Nora's wearing is perfect with it. <laughs> okay. I'm only showing y'all a couple Minnetonka shoes, but make sure to check out the website because all the new styles are on the website. Don't forget, we do have an awesome new website, saxonshoes.com. So, we got the closed version from Minnetonka as well and a really sweet baby blue and the black. It's um, a little less fur lined, but you still have that entire fur lined. So a shoe like this is great because a lot of people will use it as a slipper, especially the ones with like plantar fasciitis or any feet problems. This is great to wear around the house as your slipper because you get a little bit more support than just a flat shoe, um, but you can also wear it out. Love the blue. Blue's really cute, gonna match everything. One of those denim neutrals. Love it. Um, I'm gonna do Piccolinos next. I know I have a ton of Piccolinos fans out there. The leather is like butter, it feels so good. I actually have a pair on today. Two new styles that we just got in. This is the San Sebastian. Oh, Dad, I'm blanking. The hood, um, what do you call? Leather. Well, no, the riding boot style. Why am I blanking? Well, you guys know what I mean. It's got that cool look to it, the little riding boot cut to it. It's got a lot of intrigue to it, but what you guys know Piccolina is for the best is their amazing leather. This feels like butter. It molds to your foot. You've got nice cushion in it. Let's see if I can show you all the inside. You know, it's got really nice cushion. It's got that nice suede lining to it. I know, Becca, these are so cute. I love the lug bottom. Um, right now, I love that kind of everything's on trend. You're gonna see a little bit of more sleek. You're gonna see some lug. You're gonna see some wedges. You're gonna see some high heels. And that's the best part about fashion today is literally everything's on trend. So on one side, you've got your zipper entry. On the other side, you've got a little faux zipper just for an accent. You've got your cognac and your black. And your black has a little bit of a chocolate trim to it. If you can see that, it's really beautiful. So these are actually 230, very beautiful. And then we got a classic style from them. Short boot, a little higher front to back. This is gonna be very comfortable on the back of your ankle. Easy, great transition boot, goes with everything. So right now, a boot like this, it's still great to show some leg. So I'm gonna grab some clothes. So what you can do, you got a plain cotton dress for the mornings when it's a little bit colder. Slip on a little cardigan, you have your little boots. This is the easiest outfit you can ever do and you're gonna look good and cute and you didn't put much effort into it. So, love this. You know, when it gets warmer throughout the day, take off your cardigan, you're still comfortable. You got on your cute boots, you, boots, you feel fall, love it. I brought in my closet today. <laughs> so, 
So, um, I actually am teetering with doing a live video from my closet. I don't know which shoe closet I'd pick. Um, I have one of those old city houses, so all my closets are really narrow and deep, so my shoes have kind of exploded into about four closets at this point. But I thought it'd be cool to do a, a live video from one of my closets. Um, I have a couple more Piccolino's boots. I'm obsessed with this one. This winter white, this off-white color is just gorgeous. You've got about a one and a half inch heel. Just adorable. It's got a great leather liner to it. You know, it makes a huge difference when your liner is real leather versus faux leather. It's gonna definitely make your feet not sweat as much. Um, this boot is phenomenal. I'm one of those people that loves white after Labor Day and I think pairing a white and a winter white together is always just very classy and classic. Um, winter white is absolutely gorgeous. I just have such fond memories of my grandma in her winter white suits. You know, she had the trousers with the matching blazer and she just mm, oozed class. Well, I mean, all the time oozed class, but I love that winter white. And then we also have it in the cognac. This is one of my favorite boots already. I'm actually wearing it today. Let's see if I can manipulate this well. So, as y'all can see, I'm just wearing a jean dress. But jean dress and cognac boots, this is gonna be a very big staple for me this year. Just an easy throw on, run out of the house. Better than just wearing shorts and flip flops. Love these. Okay. Hi, Cooper. <laughs> so, lastly from Piccolino's, I picked out a cool combat boot. This is really on trend this year. Um, this is something that I know the kids are wearing all year round, which is really cool. Um, but think about it. If you're still warm and you still wanna wear some shorts, you got some great cords. Um, I'm a big earth tone, so you'll see a lot of wines, greens, navies, but how good does that look together? If you still wanna wear a pair of shorts, some maroon shorts with these cool combat boots, you've got a cushioned collar to it. You've got a zipper entry over here. That way, do your laces. Good morning, Betty. They can stay and you just use the zipper to get in and out. Nice lug bottom again. And again, I'm not showing all the styles that we got in from Piccolino, so be sure to check out the website, saxonshoes.com. How many times have I plugged that now? <laughs> so, last but not least, I know I have been talking about the Regarde boots coming in. Gary, when are you put a tall boot back there? Uh, so, true to form, my dad's adding shoes after I started. I wasn't gonna show tall boots yet, just because it is still so warm out. Um, biggest debate of fall 2020 is suede or leather. <laughs> it's the biggest debate of fall 20, right? So I know that, I got this. My mom's giving me pointers on the side. She wants me to remind y'all that all Regarde boots are lined with this ridiculously soft, suede on there i mean i this is like not to compare it but this is literally like having an ugg boot on i mean an ugg blanket on your foot inside these are amazing they've got nice cushion inside of them nice block heel for comfort only about an inch and a half tall again this is the new tracy it comes in suede as well as leather so i'd love to know are y'all suede or leather hey get back over here model Taylor? Oh, I thought it was Tracy. It's Taylor. Excuse me. Her name is Taylor because shoes are she and he. Here's my model. Beautiful mom. Mary, you're a leather girl. I'm a both. I really do like both. I'm a huge sucker for the smell of leather, um, which always draws me to it. But at the same time, I love a good suede. Karen, I am so ready for boots too. I'm already wearing some today. So, 
Next we have the Isabel. We've had this before in this really cool pepper color, but this year we got it in a black and a cognac. I love the belt accent too. It just makes it cool and fashion. You've got your zipper entry on the inside. Again, it's got the beautiful liner to it. God, I mean, like, I can't tell y'all, this is so amazing inside of there. These boots are like butter. One of my favorite things about Regarde is it's one of those shoes that literally just molds to your foot. So this is one of those boots that I have really good luck with on narrow feet because it's gonna hug your foot. And then for even wide feet, this works well for me because that leather is so buttery that it just gives. So this is Isabel with the really cool belting. Beautiful. And then Gary did want me to show two tall boots, nice moderate heel, beautiful ruching on the front of it. It's got the beautiful um, liner like all the Regarde boots too. Also comes in black. And then you have a leather and suede combo. This is great with skinny jeans, you know, pair it with a dress, just cool. Um, I know he wanted me to show this, but I think it's a little early weather-wise for this, but I'm excited. Uh, so y'all stay tuned because I'm gonna be back with some kid shoes right after, but I wanted to go back. Um, well, I'll go back through once dad does his thing. Okay, you ready? Yes. Oh, I'm not done yet. So like I said, I brought in my closet. Jean jacket for pairing things is the best. Jean jacket should be staple in everybody's closet. This is one of my favorite cardigans. This is from UGG. We had it in last year, but we will be getting a ton of their apparel in next year, this year too, in a couple weeks. But this is just a good piece, like we talked about the layering with the other cardigan. You know, throw that over a dress or a pair of jeans, and that's something you can take off later in the day. Or we always have a great selection of capes. These are not on the website yet, but we'll have them up today. And this is just easy with a dress or a pair of jeans, just to throw it on top with a nice little bl uh, blouse underneath. And for those colder mornings, you have that extra layer, but then for the afternoon, bam, she gone. Okay, dad, you ready? Gary. Gary. <laughs> Good morning. I'm proud to be Amanda's dad. And she asked me to say a few things about some men's shoes this morning, which I will be happy to do. So if you look up top here, it's Hold trend on. now. I'm gonna um, set you up with a stand. Okay, but I wanna show some stuff on the floor as well. Okay. So first of all, we have a lot of Clarks. I need that over here, please. Okay. You can't hold that for me? I will. Okay. So Clark is a, a year-round staple, but back to school, fall, a holiday, it's all about beeswax. Now you can see you've got the low wallaby, you've got the mid wallaby, you've got the desert boot, plain toe, which is the difference in the desert boot versus the wallabies, and then the fashion version, which is kind of like the desert boot, except they put it on a lug sole, a little trendier. Uh, all beeswax, and again, all of these are on our website under the Clark name or under the men's area. So I would check these out. Uh, I will tell you that chucka boots are really happening. Any kind of chucka boot, desert boot, are all happening. As a matter of fact, Amanda will show you that I'm wearing some Johnston Murphy chucka boots today. So I'm on up. trend, Gary Weiner. So I even have a matching belt on, which I'm not going to show you. <laughs> So, uh, the, the other couple of brands I really want to focus on, can you hold that and kind of move around, yeah. is uh, Johnston Murphy. Johnston Murphy, premier brand for Saxons. This is the Prentice, comes in leather, comes in suede, gray suede, navy suede, unbelievably comfortable. The insert actually comes out if your foot is a little wider. It's got the same comfort features, but these shoes are great. I've got this shoe in two colors. Probably the top seller. For it's men waterproof. From Johnston. Yep, waterproof as well. Johnston Murphy. This is McGuffey. McGuffey comes 
perp, it comes laced, it comes in navy, it comes in gray. Top selling color is the natural brown. But these McGuffies are extremely comfortable. They got a lot of padding, kind of the shoe that you can put on, feel good when you put it on and feel good when you take it off. So I would check out uh, these and then a lot of guys like slip-ons. These shoes, tried and true. Classic. Classic. Uh, you know, not much you can really say about these except slip them on, feel the comfort, you know, knock around the house, wear them with a pair of khakis, wear them with a pair of shorts. They work really well. And of course, I told you about chuckas. The other word is a C also, Chelsea. Chuckas and Chelsea's. This is the key to the fall wardrobe for a lot of guys. Uh, these are all on our website under Johnston Murphy. And the last brand I want to show you is a brand that we go with some of our friends, independents, small stores like Saxon and others, and we travel the world. We found this brand out of Brazil. It's uh, pronounced Gavota, G-A-I-V-O-T-A. And these are really soft and supple shoes, kind of along the vein of an Echo. But again, it's the Chelsea boot, brown leather, brown nubuck, black leather. Nice and then pebbled leather. It's Pretty. covered pebble grain, which is really nice. It's got the goring here, which is really comfortable. And again, really flexible. And then the, chel the uh, chucka boots again. The chucka boots come a little more pointed, a little more fashion, a little more everyday, black brown comfort features these shoes are really modestly priced most of these are somewhere in the 125 to 175 range and we've got a great selection in stock and this brand is on our website too it's spelled g-a-i-v-o-t-a -A. there's a lot more shoes from them a lot more from j&m and from clark but this is what we wanted to feature today and i want to thank amanda for inviting me <laughs> inviting you okay so, let me move my little stand over. Okay, last but not least, I did have a couple kid shoes I wanted to talk about today. Um, going off of his theme of the chucka boots and everything, I know I've talked about Footmates many times before, but they do a great version of the Clark's Wallaby. We've got the high and the low version for kids. Um, Emily, Footmates goes to a three. So these come up to a size three and they come small as well. Super cute, they've got the gum bottom. James loves them. Oh, you got them yesterday, that's awesome, Mary. So, ooh, low internet connection. Am I here, do y'all see me? Perfect. So we've got the beeswax brown as well as the sand, the dirty butt color. Love both of these. You know, unfortunately, Clark's does not sell kid shoes in the United States, so this is a great option. And for those of you that know Footmates, you know the fit and the comfort is perfect, and they've got that custom insole system to them. So for those of you with medium feet, you leave in the one insole. If you have a wide foot, they have a second insole in the box that you just switch them out. It's a little bit thinner, gives you that little bit of extra room you need. If you have a narrow foot, you actually put in both, which is great for kids that are growing. You know, it just lets you have a little bit more flexibility in your shoes. We don't have kids shoes on the website yet, but we're thinking about it. I was interested to see what y'all thought about that. You know, we are known for our sizing, especially in our kids department. So I just didn't want to mess with that. <laughs> How did that just happen? Um, so we're known for our fitting, so I just, I, y'all just let me know. I'd love to be able to put those on the website if you thought that was a good idea. Mary said she'd appreciate them. Okay, okay. So I wanted to show you a couple other footmates. I'm actually bring it over here. So I know kids are at home right now primarily, but you can still do cute and a little bit more dressed up even with your athletic bottoms. So these have the great rubber gum soles to them, but you've got your nice T-strap. So this would look cute with the dresses, with the shorts, but they can also play and run around in these. You got your little Mary Jane style with your wingtip on it. 
I love this kind of tailored look to it on the Mary Jane. Comes in a bunch of colors. Again, all the footmates are gonna have the custom fit system in them. And then for your little tykes, God, aren't these cute. I'm really into this kick pad. This is great for kids that are first walking because if they stumble into something, they're not going to mess up the integrity of the front of the shoe. They're going to get the rubber kick pad on there. And then I thought this little platinum Mary Jane was just adorable. So this is kind of my take on kids at home, but still want to look cute. And then we did just get in these new crib shoes from Minnetonka. Like, can I die right now? These are so cute. I love the little moccasins. I love, love, love this leopard print. It's got a nice little faux hair on it. These are so cute. <laughs> so those are new. We just got those in. Catherine, you probably haven't even seen those yet, but I am sure my little Lachlan's going to get a pair of those probably today. Um... So it's just to scroll back through the women's shoes, you've got your Regarde. You've got your Piccolinos. Love the combat boot. And then your Minnetonkas, little mules. Did you already change out of your shoes? And then your chocolate blues as well. So we will do more kids shoes coming up too. And then wanted to thank my models. Yeah. Okay, guys. This was one of our longer videos, but I'm really excited because fall goods are starting to flood in. So um, we will definitely continue doing these weekly to show y'all everything. Plus, you know, maybe we'll do a bigger video coming up to maybe on a Sunday afternoon or something like that so we could show more shoes at once. Um, but thank y'all so much for tuning in, and I will see you next week. Have a great week.